Hi guys, 2nd of September, Friday 2nd of September, um, just got another update from Netherton Plot. Um, nice sunny day, well a bit cloudy earlier but it's a nice evening. Anyway, big changes, I'm trying to not spoil the excitement. Things are growing still. Clear all this bed out, finish all the wood off. Got some more wood to come anyway to do the raised beds, and then all this is going to be full of manure and whatever for next year. Um, courgettes, I'm getting loads. Here's me two monsters. There you go. Let's pull out a bit. There you go. Just do this as a bit of fun. I'm not going for any world record. I'm literally doing this for a bit of fun, and as I said before, I've not watered anything here, but I'm not joking here, that's the biggest bugger I've, I've ever grown in life. Um, but not squashes, the other ones, down here, doing well, looking healthy, and I'm getting more butternut squash, considering they were all yellow, that's really perked up. Um, I'm really surprised a lot of the stuff I've put in. Even my cabbage just start to grow again. Savoy cabbage, another woe falling at home. That's all going to change now. My beans, let's just have a quick look at these. But not squashes. Oh my god, I think I've got some runner beans here that need picking as well. But uh, let's know. Uh, well, you didn't see any of that, did you? I'm rubbish with the camera, I do apologize. Here you go, these have come out again. These have gone, oh my god, I haven't seen these. These have gone absolutely ballistic again. With the rain that we've had. Oh my word. They've shot up in four days. No word of a lie. I have not watered any of this. I'm not going to lie. I don't believe in lying. But I'm not, I have not watered anything. We've had some rain. But, oh crikey, look at the size of these. They're getting even big. Oh, brilliant. I've got somebody at work, bless her, that she's a vegetarian. So she loves, obviously, a veg. And I said today, do you like butternut squash? She said, yes. So this one is for you, Becky. Okay. And you can even tell me which one you bloody well want when it's ripe. Let's see if I can get to it, because... Oh, anyway, they're down here somewhere. Oh crikey, oh my god, that's huge, that's a butternut squash guys, um, should I just leave it, well it's got a, I'm trying to go, oh no, well, that's sounding stupid. It was about 10 times the size I've ever grown in five years of growing. It's 10 pence a piece. There's another one there. And there's more growing. Sweet corn's doing brilliantly. And I can see there's loads of beans there. I'm going to have to get my daughter to come down one of the days. And now I've got to try and tread the the butternut squash. Whoa! Made it. Um, I don't know, even look underneath this. Have you got any more flowers? I think they did have. There's some forming down there. Um, look at it. That is one. Oh, can't believe it. I'm so dead chuffed. Here's the big thing, polytunnel, it's up, it's just got a few adjustments to do, there you go, I'm just going to about to put some more uprights in the buckets on each one, and the wooden pieces behind, I'll show you, 
you've seen these before but this oops sorry guys let's go in there let's go straight through there into that and about an outside of this into this with a packer they ain't going nowhere few adjustments to make, torque this up a bit, I'm trying to let the sun get a good go at it, stretch it a bit, torque it all up, is that a word, torque it all up, you know what I mean guys, straighten the seams, it's looking good now, well pleased, yeah, it's all looking good. the top part looking down had a bit of rain I might have to walk to these I meant to be carrots they were forming but yeah. you get back to your beetroot you can't see the beetroot here if I get anything I'll get anything if I don't I don't but I've got to weed all this take me five seconds to do and then all this bit. There's all the wood that go inside. Oh, dead chuffed. Anyway, guys, maybe you can hear me. I might get a microphone one of the days. I should do that as I'm a trumpet player, as well as a silver seven by day, professional trumpet player. So uh, I have got microphones. Not necessarily the ones I use on this, but hey ho. There you go. Rather long update. But there she is. In fact, I might sell the house and just move in here, I think. It's lovely and warm in here. Cheers, guys. Bye.